Colab is the Google's cloud based platform for uh, executing our Python code. So, it is a cloud based, so we need not install anything. You just search Colab Google, you will come out with collabresearch.google.com. Let us click this. We are now ready because I have logged in, it is uh, already taken to my account. Uh, you, what is required is a uh, Gmail ID or a Google account to work on the Google Colab. Now, here you can create a new notebook by clicking this or I can see the examples whatever is provided and whatever uh, I can move here are the examples the recently whatever I work. I can work on any file in my Google Drive or I can pull or push uh, my files to the GitHub repository if I have anything and another thing is you can upload my local host if any I have any uh, python files a dot py or ipnyv files i can upload it and start working on that so this is are the what are then what is the main advantage of uh, using google uh, collab is uh, i need not have to install anything on my system and provides me many libraries to work in different areas of python we just need to call the required library and start using advanced data analytics and machine learning libraries are also there all our files are hosted in Google Drive, so it is easy to share with others and manage them. Files can be uploaded or downloaded from your machine, so I can push it to that uh, from the GitHub also. I can use the my files whatever is I have kept on GitHub. So and even Google can give me my uh, tensor processing unit, TPU, GPU, graphic processing unit, and additional CPUs based on my requirement. So that is the main advantage of using Colab. From our Google Drive also, we can uh, open our uh, Google Colab. So, you will go to new, then go to more, you can see here Google Colab tree is there. But if it for the first time you are using, if it, this app is not connected, you can go here, connect more apps and then search for uh, Colab and uh, connect it to your drive. Now, let us go to Google Colab tree. Now, this will open a blank Python file for me to work with. So, this is directly I am working on the Google platform now. So, using the cloud platform is better that I need not have to maintain it. Now, here I can change my file name. So, first let us say my I am changing the file name here. I am giving the name my file ipynb this is extension and this is my python code area. And uh, you can see there is a code area, there is a text area also. I can let us see first I will add a text area. So, this is a text area added. I can move it up before my code area. So, I will enter it my first python code. Fine, I will come to the now my code area, the message is there at the top. Now, let me just print hello world. You can write anything and this is the execute button I have executed. First time when I we are executing, you watch this, this will connect it, it will take bit time, but next time onwards it will be connected and the resources allotted to us by Google. So, we will be using this. You can share it also. This file can be shared to your friends and anybody who can give with access restrictions and whatever you want. So, that is the beauty of you working on a cloud platform. Now, this see the code is executed and we have got the output here. I can add a text area also. Let us see my second area. Anything you want you can put it second line. Okay, Let us go back to our when you click outside this is there. So, beyond that let us put another one more code line. So, this code block is added here. Now, this file also I can go to the file menu save uh, or download it as ipny file or download as py file and other options are there. I can upload a notebook also you can explore this one. Now, let us find out what is the version Google is running here? What is the Python version? So, let us see. I am giving a small command now version. This should tell me what is the Python I am running. Now, the advantage yeah, Python 3.6.9. So, the advantage is I need not upgrade all the time. A new version comes. If it is in my local machine, then I have to upgrade it, download it. All, all already this job is done by Google. So, I have my job is to only to use it. This Google platform uh, collab will be using for our learning other Python functions and applications, whatever we will develop.